Hey guys, what's going on? This is Charles at Corona Geek, and today we're going to review Finger Hula. Finger Hula was sent to me by Ian Masters, and it's a fun, creative, and addictive game. I like it, my family likes it, and I think you're going to like it too. Now, I don't want to spend a whole lot of time talking about it. I just kind of want to jump right in and show it to you because it's a little difficult to explain. While you may think that Finger Hula sounds like it's fairly intuitive, there's a lot more to it than that, and I need to show it to you. So let's go ahead and jump on into level one. In level one, it starts out with a tutorial that shows you how you play. Basically, you need to keep your peg over your note for an allotted amount of time so that you can uh, accomplish that note and move on to the next one. So I'm just going to tap on the screen here. I'm going to take control of the hula, and I'm going to go ahead and hover over the first note, hover over the second note, and you have to hold it there long enough and then go ahead and hold, hover over the third note. Now, if you notice in the upper left-hand corner, there's a series of dots that denote how many notes you need to play for that level. So I'm almost there. I'm just going to let that go and let it kind of just fall to the ground. And done. So that's that's level one. Now, each level gets progressively harder as you move along, and uh, it does get fairly complicated as you go. So the first screen of levels kind of just gets you introduced to it, and then after that, it just re it really takes begins to take off. One of the things that it does do is it lets you play the left and right finger. So here's the left uh, finger uh, because that's not my dominant hand. I started out with my right finger. Now it's going to let me play with my left finger. But I'm going to go ahead and, and tap on pause. That gives brings up a menu item where I can go back to the levels. And I'm going to go ahead and jump into level 8 to kind of jump ahead and show you how, how that works. Once you've had an opportunity to play both sides, uh, things get a little more interesting. Then it begins to switch from left to right during each level and your scale gets broken up into different fragments and it makes it much much harder for you to accomplish the level. So here I'm going to go start out with the left uh, just uh, kind of try to stay there. You can adjust the sensitivity and the settings to, so that your peg doesn't move so fast when you hula. Uh, so if you have you want to adjust your sensitivity you can so that right there I did the left side and now it's flipped over and it's making me do the right side some of the other features of the app are you can share your score so if you tap on the winners cup there on the screen you can share your score on Facebook you can see some of the related apps that uh, they recommend inside of finger hula and then if you want you can tap on the settings now the settings for this game are just as intuitive as the game itself so if you want to change uh, some of the settings there you can if you want to change the left and right orientation which finger is your dominant finger you can change that you can also change whether or not it shows you the music scale and then like I said before you can adjust the sensitivity of your peg so it makes it a little easier for you to keep it in those slots while you're trying to hula now you can tap on the trash can there if you want to reset everything and start back from scratch you can do that but I'm not going to do that so let's go ahead and go back to the levels here and take a look uh, this is a very interesting game it's extremely creative and extremely addictive I think these guys have done a, an excellent job putting this together and they used the Corona SDK to build this app so that's something definitely that we like to see at Corona Labs is people building creative addictive apps that other people uh, enjoy using using the Corona SDK and I like I like to see that uh, so for sure so Ian thank you for sending this to me all right so that's just a quick look at Finger Hula it's a nice fun addictive game something that you'll definitely enjoy get a lot of play out of I think uh, for 99 cents it's a great deal you can find it in the Apple App Store you can find it on Google Play and you can also find it on the Amazon Store as well so go ahead and go out and pick that up right now I think you're gonna really enjoy it and so until next time have fun and keep on playing